What is up guys? Juan here, Grease Busters Cleaning. Today we are finishing up some junk removal from the other day. Got Tyler with me, got the dumpster out. We had another job lined up for the day, but I think they just rescheduled, so I'm honestly okay with it. We're gonna finish up this junk removal here. We're gonna get paid, I gotta go collect some invoices. And then we're good. My car's at the alignment shop. We're drifting this weekend, so everything's good. We're finishing out our week. Got some house washes tomorrow. So we're all good. So I'm gonna show you what we're working with and let's get started. All right, so as you can see, I have this big metal pile here. Not big, it's all really light metal. And we're finishing up this pile of garbage here. So not too bad. We'll just fill the bottom of the trailer and then we'll be able to take all the scrap without overloading anything. So this is nice. Let's get it. And cart. All pulled out. <laughs> they see me rolling. <laughs> the kid in me wants to use this thing so badly. And mind you guys, this is the same guy who was haggling about my price, and it's too much after we pulled the $500 load out of here. And now we have this. And he wanted me to do it all of this for $300 absolutely ridiculous you know, you'd think business owners would have the same you know at least same sort of thinking and concept when it comes to overhead and expenses you see i have a truck trailer employee you know but it's what it is we're gonna be all right so almost half a trailer load probably like four yards of stuff let's go check out the after I'm going to put a picture right now of what it looks like. And this is what it's like now. You call, we haul. Not at some other junk removal company thing. But came out nicely. And we got paid. Um... I personally, I'm not sure if I'll work for this customer again if they call me. Because I don't think it's worth the headache that comes with it. But and I know I don't normally talk like that on the channel because money is money. But some customers, you know, some customers could get fired. And I think this is one of the customers that will not be coming back out for. It's just not worth the haggling and all that that comes with it. And our price is our price. You guys know that. I feel like I always talk about it. But whatever. Good day. Easy money. All right, guys. If you like the video, if you hate the video, drop a comment. Let me know. Until next time, peace. Keep making that money. Tyler, where are you? Over here. Peace out. Say bye to the camera. Stop, babe. Yes, sir. Until next time.